City correspondent Dominga Murray, and I'm here at the Everglades Wonder Gardens. And with this brand new 10-year partnership with the city, there's some big changes coming to the zoo. Well, we've had flamingos that needed to go home with staff. Uh, we had other small birds that went home with staff. Uh, we also, I also this in my office. We put the giant tortoises in my office. In other words, it's been anything but easy since Hurricane Ian flooded the gardens with three feet of storm surge, followed by a long road to recovery. For months, Fox 4 has told you about the relationship between the city and the gardens. We've now learned that changes council members want to see are happening. Neil Armstrong is the CEO of the Wonder Gardens. A couple of the things that stuck out to me were code issues. I think they mentioned the bathroom and accessible ramps. So is that something that's going to change? Absolutely. You know, that was one of the things that I know they uh, have had a risk assessment uh, study done, which was great because that's kind of part of that whole master plan. Bringing these bathrooms up to the Americans with Disabilities compliance is on the city's list of requests, along with the asbestos remediation in the admin building and stylistic changes, too. Imagine this. So you're going to start on the canopy tour way on that far end. A new exhibit tortoises of the world. So you're going to come through, you probably would be at least probably 10 foot high here. It's going to actually come across the walkway here and you can see as you go right through here that banyan tree, that large banyan tree, well that's where it's going to end and that's where the tree house is going to be. Soon you'll be able to see the gardens from a whole new level and some exhibits with concrete slabs you'll be able to see into, like this mock-up. We can't wait to get everybody involved with renewing the wonder because we want this, you know, like I say, to, to be here for generations to come. In Bonita Springs, Dominga Murray, Fox 4.